Hi everyone, this is Danny for Dude Tech and welcome back with another video. So in today's video, first of all, I'm going to be talking about Gablin. So Gablin has been released the first beta and it's right now on a public. So if you want to talk about the RC1 and what is all that about. So first of all, Gablin is going to be specific for the 64-bit devices on the iOS 10 up to iOS 10.3.3. And uh, just to give you guys a little quick about how is uh, everything is going to be work about Goblin if you are uh, already in you so this is the website which is uh, I'm gonna be a leave for you guys in the description down below you need to come here to download the IPA file go ahead and just click on download that's gonna be download the IPA file right away for you once you uh, download the IPA file you need the CD impactor which is I'm gonna be leave the uh, website for you you have to make sure you get the last version of CD impactor in order to uh, get the IPA file set up on your iDevice. So once you finish everything, go ahead and just launch the CD Impactor. Your IPA file will be uh, anywhere you put it. Uh, just go ahead right now and connect your device by the USB cable with your computer. It doesn't matter if it's going to be Windows or a Mac system or even Linux because all of those is going to be available. So go ahead right now and just drag and drop that IPA file on the CD Impactor. It's going to be asking you to sign in with your Apple ID. Go ahead and just type in your Apple ID and your password and it's going to be good to go. And here is the Twitter account for the same developer who already created the Goblin, the RC1. He is right now talking about the RC1 and right now let's talk about most of the things. So right now the developer, he gets a lot of feedback from a lot of people right now. If you want to go through a lot of comments here because most of the people uh, when they use before the release, the Xcode, the Goblin it's more stable than right now. Uh, so right now there is uh, sometimes if you want to jailbreak with Goblin, it might that is you have some issue with the running Cydia. Sometimes Cydia will be pop up, sometimes it's not. So you need to mess around with some files. But I do recommend you guys to stay away right now from RC1. It might the developer he is gonna be patch a lot of things and he is gonna be doing update. That's for sure. So stay away right now from the RC1. That's because we are still an, on a beta status and uh, this is just the first release of that Jello break. So you might have a lot of issue. Don't mess around with your device. Don't mess around with the file system. Just uh, just stay a little bit and uh, give it a time a little bit. Once we see the, the second or the third, the fourth beta will be came. I think it will be much stable than right now and everything will be all right. The next thing that I'm going to be talking about here about Goblin. So Goblin, you need to sign in Goblin just like Yellow, which is going to be every seven days. You need to keep in mind. So if you're already Jolly Broken right now, you need to keep in mind that you need to be signing Goblin every seven days from now on. Talking about Goblin and about the tweaks, I'm going to be attached for you guys, which you will be find in the description down below. A list which is going to be uh, giving you a lot of information about which tweak will be compatible right now for that moment with Goblin, which was uh, which one is going to be working, uh, wh which one is not going to be work. So as you guys can see here on the left, the tweak's name and here is going to be showing you if it's working or is not going to be working. And then also, as you guys can see here, we have the section of the devices here. So we will be have an information about what most of the tweaks is going to be compatible for that moment with Goblin and uh, for sure that is not going to be take a long time because I'm pretty sure as I told you guys the developer he will be push a lot of uh, beta status a lot of beta files from now on because right now uh, he's working really hard about uh, fixing a lot of issues and as I told you guys this is the RC1 so this is gonna be the first beta if you want to go ahead and jailbreak with Goblin it's gonna be up to you it's your own risk the next thing that I'm going to be talking about it, really I don't want to talk about it and make a video and explain things which is I don't really and I see that is nothing really interesting to talking about it but by the way there is a uh, new semi jailbreak has been released which is going to be Electra 
and uh, this is gonna be a semi jello break which is pretty much it looks like houdini if you guys remember abraham masari he's the developer who already created Houdini, the uh, semi jello break for the iOS 11 up to iOS 11.1.2. Today, there is another developer which is going to be a cool star here. He is the developer who already created the Electra here. And I'm going to be leave for you guys. The link will be in the description down below if you want to give it a try. But guys, this is going to be a semi jello break. So if you want to uh, get the Electra in your iDevice, eye, eye keep in mind there is no CD on it so th this is the difference between the jello break and the semi jello break if you want to give it a try it's gonna be up to you Ultra is gonna be support the uh, uh, iOS uh, 11 up to iOS 11.1.2 on most the devices as you guys can see here the de developer already uh, talking about the support devices so if you want to download the IPA file go ahead and just click on download the IPA file will be uh, start downloading using the CD impactor same thing you can just uh, download that application in your art device and pretty much as I told you guys most of the thing is not really that much interesting to talking about it and make a video about it but if you want to go ahead and download it it's up to you and uh, also I'm gonna be leave for you guys in the description the cool star Twitter account if you want to follow up with him if you want to understand most of the things get some information it's gonna be up to you this is the most information that I have for you guys in today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you like the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe for more videos and I catch you guys with the next one. Peace.